start with a dry, clean face, and I'm starting with my Clinique. Moisturizing lotion is good for dry and combination skin, so yeah, you should go check that out if you have dry or dry combination skin. It's really good for it. So I'm going to go in with my Shella Eyebrow Pencil. It's in the Dazzling Dark Brown. And I'm going to use the NT50 Studio Finish Concealer from MAC to line my eyebrows to clean them up. Too Faced Shadow Insurance. It's the eye primer. If you want your eye, your eye shadow to last all day, it's good to use the primer. And if you want to go for that extra step, you can use the, you can use the um a concealer to match your skin color. And I'm using the NW45 and that, if, especially if you have discoloration in in your eyes, it's good to mute out the color so your colors will pop even more. I'm gonna use the BH Party Girl palette and I'm gonna go and use this soft pink purple salmon color. It's really pretty. I'm gonna put that in the center of my eye, my eyelid, and I'm just gonna pat it on because I want the pigmentation to pop really good. Now I'm going to go in the same palette and use this, this pretty purple and I'm going to put this in my crease and I'm just going to swipe it back and forth. Now I'm going into my Urban Decay palette and I'm going to use this color Zero. It's a black. You don't have to use this exact black. You can use any black. And I'm going to put this on my outer and inner corner of my eyes. And I'm going to sweep, sweep, sweep it a little um, on my, my crease area. I feel like I can't. So now I'm going to take a real fluffy brush and I'm going to blend. The key to makeup is to blend, 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 especially if you're a darker shade. You can wear any color you want as long as you know how to blend. Now I'm going to take my e.l.f. cream eyeliner and I'm just going to um, paint on a really thin line and I'm just going to wing it out a little bit. Now I'm taking this Jessie Girl liquid eyeliner and I'm going to put that on top of, on top of the um, liner that I previously used and I also added some falsies so yeah. Now I'm going to use the my Maybelline the false, um, falsies by Express um, mascara and I'm going to put that on my top my upper lashes because I want my lashes to blend and I'm going in with my NW45 and I'm going to put that on the bottom of my 
eyelids just um, to get some decoloration away because it looked like I haven't slept. So now I'm going with the L'Oreal Magic Perfect Base. Put that over my face and I'm going to use my Dream, my Maybelline, um, my Maybelline BB Cream and I'm going to add that to my face also. Now I'm going in my MAC Pro Long Concealer. It's in the color NC50. And I'm just going to put that on my under my eyelids. And I'm just going to blend that out with my finger. And I'm going to take my Banana Luxury Powder. And I'm going to put that um, to set my concealer under my eye. And I'm going back into that purple. And I'm going to put that in my lower my lower eye lid and yes so it's like a pop of color now I'm gonna go into my black radiance pressed powder and the color rich mahogany and I'm gonna use that to give me a color a light contour on my face I'm going into this Milani and NYX um, blush powder. It, I mixed it to give me this very reddish, pinkish color on my cheeks. And I'm taking my MAC mineralizing powder and I'm putting this all over my face. It's in the color dark. And I'm going to set my whole face with this powder. I love this powder. If you don't got it, you should try it. Okay, so now I'm going to go into my Georgiana lip pencil. And I'm going to outline and fill in my lips. This is a really pretty plum purple color. And then I'm going to go into my Sephora palette. And I'm going to use this purple plum lip um, color. And I'm going to use a lighter pink color. And I'm going to use those together. And it's going to give me this per perfect Plum, purple, pink color. It just, it's just so pretty together. Oh my gosh, I just love it. So I had to put it together. And I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for watching. If you have any comments, make sure you leave the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe.